taking video the garage door didn't open up for me so I'm taking video tape because I had to call use the intercom system to get the garage door open and it didn't open and now the next person behind me I suspect is having to do the same thing because uh, the door is not opening for him either him or her and I'll send this to Sandy Fiore and uh, she'll probably do nothing about it as usual but let's just keep filming and see what happens see how long it takes them to get in this is going a minute 31 seconds right now and these poor people can't uh, get through the door one of the nicer buildings in Chicago it's being ruined by poor maintenance poor management poor supervision and there's another car coming behind uh, the car that's trying to get in that one probably can't get in either so we're filming this here Oh, I had to open the door for him. I had to get out of his car. Yep, this is uh, good, interesting stuff. And I'm driving up to my garage space. I get to see everything every night when I come in. Every night, pretty much, I would say a third, 30%, or 10 days a month, there's something wrong in this garage. Something not being properly handled. Something prop properly not working. In, 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 uh, that should be... looked after and cared for and maintenanced. So my next call is to the building and safety and um, I'm going to find out what's going on here. I'm tenacious and tenacity has a way of overcoming what I would call complete lackadaisical management And the I don't care attitude. See that uh, junction box up there? That was just covered up after I noted to Sandy Fiore that it was an open exposed box. There's a lot of them like that around here. I could take some more pictures for you, but uh, I don't have the time tonight. And we're just going to find out. We're going to call Building and Safety and we're going to call Chicago Fire Department and uh, see what they got to think. What's that rag hanging off of uh, that steel pipe over there? Is that to keep a leak from leaking? You know, there's a thousand things that I could point out going wrong here, but none of them get addressed. And you guys want to debate whether you want to pay for the roof of my car that's been totally destroyed because of your garage doors? Sandy Fiore doesn't want to acknowledge my emails, the same emails that I send in asking for reimbursement. Doesn't want to acknowledge they exist. She acknowledged uh, one email that existed that I said I'm glad my kids weren't injured when they were in the car with me. But that was out of common courtesy. I'm sure there is some kind of human bone in her body, but I don't think there's a sympathetic one. And I don't think that uh, she cares what goes on in this building. I was born and raised in skyscrapers. Started out 505 Lakeshore Drive, 1000 Lakeshore Plaza. Been at the very best of the buildings. And I gotta tell you, this is the most poorly run building 
And we ought to be ashamed of ourselves as owners, association members, and management company. And I will, I promise you, that I will be running for a seat on that homeowners association. You can bet your dollar on that.